For 14 years, I've been a private eye. And in my line of work, you meet some interesting people. But there was this one guy especially. He was really something. His name was Harry Adams. I didn't know Harry Adams back in 63. That was to come a lot later. By the time we did meet, I thought I'd seen every caper there was. But Harry was going to pull the one to top them all. Eight, uh, 22 and 5, 10. I kept you so long. You know I don't like sitting alone at a bar. It makes me feel like a pickup or something. I'm sorry. Yeah, the baggage uh, check is inside. What time is it? No, we should learn to wear a watch. It's 4.35. Gotcha, so. Well, what do I tell them this time? Every single time I go up to visit Mom and Dad, I go alone. I just tell them the truth. Marion, I'm in New York on business. You're always conveniently away on business. Whenever they invite us up to Portland or whenever they come down here. Why do you have to go anyway? Well, they're, you? they're expecting me. And it is important I will get to Portland if I can. Sure you will. You really don't enjoy them, do you? We'll be there along with Texas Governor John Connolly. Governor Connolly, by the way. What's so interesting? Uh, I was just trying to find out the weather in New York. <laughs> Since when does the president give the weather report on TV? Marion, I will get to Portland if I can. Well, then when can we expect you? Monday. Monday. Hmm. I better go now. I'll walk into the gate. Never mind. You wait and watch the weather report. I'll tell Mom and Dad to half expect you. <laughs> Harry had developed a blackjack system, but so far it was only theory and something to help him relax. Everybody needs a diversion, and with Harry it was blackjack. subway in New York in over 30 years. Mm. May 4th, 1934. Here we go. What's this? That's the uh, third page of the New York Sun. What's the significance? My father had that in his hand when he died. He was a mortarman on the 6th Avenue well. And reading that is what killed him. The original's buried with him. It was a year old, 1934. I was born on May 3rd, 1933. I'd like to have a copy of this. 
It's unfolded 14 years ago. Uh, Take it. I have one this. You sure? Positive. Oh. I've had it long enough. Uh, okay, Harry. Right. Don't forget we have a meeting with Bill Troy at 3. Yeah, you know. Right. Thank you. I'll be there. Thank you. Nice meeting you. Take it easy, Harry. Hello. Harry, the meeting's been canceled. Canceled? Because of what happened in Dallas. Look, there's no point in you staying over. I'll be in touch with you next week. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. What's the matter? You don't know. He's been assassinated. President Kennedy! The youngest president in the country's history murdered in his prime. I will do my best. That is all I can do. I ask for your help and God's. Bobby and Ted.